Greetings, I'm Dr. Charlie Cropley with Nourish Naturopathic Healing Arts. Uh, and today, a teaching that I want to do is on conscience. Oh my goodness. Now, central to the work that we do of self-healing is being able to govern our own behaviors wisely, to have self-discipline, self-control, the power to self-govern. Closely aligned with this power to be able to live with integrity, to direct our actions wisely, closely aligned with it is our conscience. Now, watching conscience, uh, I can remember the time when whew, my conscience shut me down, contracted me. I hid under the voice of my conscience. It was very shaming to me. I was ashamed of the things that I did that I wanted to hide, that I knew that I knew by my standards were wrong. Um, and I felt a lot of guilt. It was repressive, life dampening, right? And in my healing process, I have, I've had to face my conscience and listen to that harsh criticism. Uh, and by listening to it, uh, it's interesting. I mean, I have a critic that I wouldn't speak <laughs> here the way he speaks to me, but it's rain. Right? It's ah, in your face. By listening to that on different points, it was interesting. After listening for a little bit, the harshness began to cool down because my conscience, me, I knew I was being listened to. And so I didn't need to jam it like that. I, so in listening, this voice grew uh, more tolerable, more, uh, and I had an interest and we began to have a conversation and, uh, I remember many times we just say the, the, the voice of criticism in my conscience became a critic. It was my bud, right? Useful player on the team, someone I want. And now I can call on my critic slash my conscience and say, give me your opinion on this. Don't hold anything back. Talk to me. I'm not feeling fully good about this. And I get a, a, a critical opinion from someone who knows me and loves me. Now that's incredibly valuable. In fact, it's essential. Living in harmony with our conscience is such a blessing. Oh my goodness. And our conscience is voice of wisdom in us, directing us for what is truly in our best interest and what is good for us. So in the module that we do on self-governance, why self-governance, uh, coming to developing an honest and caring relationship with our conscience, central work. 